What's up, darts here? This is Courtney on America's Got Talent. She's got the golden buzzer from Mr. Baldy there. But when I saw this, what I saw was demonic possession. Okay, I'm not going to beat around the bush. I'm not going to mess about here. You know, basically say it how it is. Now, I've said before in previous videos that many of these pop stars, they say that something takes over them that allows them to perform, basically, from Eminem, Nicki Minaj, and so many others. You know, they openly admit to saying, something just comes over me when I perform, and I can't do it when I'm not on stage. I think that was Beyonce that said that. These pop stars, right? These singers, especially. They let something... These pop stars, these singers, they let something take over them, okay? It's a demonic entity, they don't control it. Now at first, like, you know, maybe Eminem or all these other people, they think, oh yeah, well this, this just feels good, just feels right to do. But the more they get into it, the more fa fans they get, the more the demons take over. Yeah? And you can see it. You can see it on Eminem's face when he's like, he looks like he's tweaking with his eyes twitching when he's talking about, you know, making these jokes about masturbation or other ridiculous things that are actually things he actually, you know, you know, focuses on. He does himself. You know, people should see it like a joke, and but they don't. Massive respect, even when he's acting like an idiot. But anyway, let's get back to this girl here. I want you to watch this as a classic case, if you haven't seen it already, of demonic possession. 100%. And I'm guessing you're going to be singing for us? Yeah. Listen, don't be nervous. I know this is a big stage and there's lots of people here, but you're here for a reason. So go for it and good luck. Thank you. Here we go, letting the demon come in right now. Here it comes. Waiting. Here it comes, and it comes. Uncontrollable body movements. Pick up the arm. Reminds me of Kundalini with convulsions. Now, you, know, you notice when the audience stands up is when she does more controlled movements and not quite so, you know, like, um, like almost looks like body spasms when her arms go into the side like that. The beginning. Okay. Uncontrollable movement, body movements, yeah? But as soon as the audience stands up, she starts looking a bit more professional. Style movements.
So she's completely taken over, basically, while she's performing. So I'll be keeping an eye on this one. But it's demonic possession, basically. Long story short. But uh, Britain's got talent, America's got talent, you know, the you know the X Factor, all these other sorts of programs are very, very interesting. As you see the, the artists, a lot of these people go on to become worldwide stars, yeah? Like uh, Camila Cabello, for example, whatever the hell her name is. This is I'm Demonically Possessed. Cobana, Robana, I left my heart in Coco, Bella, Robana, shut up. So there we go, I'll keep an eye on this one. But uh, what I see there is demonic possession, basically. Long story short. Uh, I mean... Yeah, I think I'll just leave it there. But uh, she She's making movements at the beginning there, like the stereotypical you know, female actress in a demonic possession movie. You know? I'll leave it there. What do you think about it? Leave your comments in the comment section and drop a like as well if you feel like it. Uh, sorry about the drop in audio. Just back here real quickly to add this little segment on the end. I forgot to mention something. Yeah, uh, The uh, audio quality goes down because of whenever I copy and paste videos together, the bit that's pasted on the quality goes down the toilet, but it should be good enough for you to hear me just say this, which I missed. Oh, I didn't miss, but I forgot to mention it. This person, this person called Courtney, the one who got the golden, golden buzzer on the, uh, on the um, America's Got Talent, has the dimensions of a male. That's what I see there. Oh, you always going on about trannies. Uh, no, I think this actually probably is a tranny. Uh, end of the day, because I mean, look at the shoulders, they're way over the hips there. So, um, if you put it into context when you're watching this, and this person's singing away, see it as a boy, not a girl. Kind of looks a bit like a boy to me. It was like, oh, how can it be a boy? All in the shoulders. I could be wrong, but I don't know. Just look at the dimensions of the shoulders over the way over the hips there. So that is a male feature. Um. So anyway, I'll leave it there. I also think she's actually British, kind of sounds British to me. But here you go, little side notes. Leave your comments in the comment section and drop a like if you want to. Or don't. Bye.